Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode here on uh, Talk Daily. Hopefully, you have a good one wherever you are there. Uh, today, I'm going to talk about some awesome technology that's coming from Hyundai. Uh, I don't think they're the first one who do this because we've seen it on the Hummer, but we might see this technology eventually trickle its way into uh, daily driven cars. Currently, it's a concept, but I love it. I've seen it on a Hummer doing a crab walk. There was a thing they were, uh, um, you know, showing on the, the Hummer. That was one of its, uh, you know, cool tricks. Well, now Hyundai is doing the same thing. Uh, so I'm going to show the little video. But before, I'll just give you credit, of course, where I got it from. I'm getting my information from Car and Driver, an article written by Mr. Brian Sylvester. As always, I have a link to everything I show you in the description below. And if you're wondering, eh, I'm not sponsored by Car and Driver, okay? I just, you know, I want to look at cars. I look at their, you know, what, what's new with there. And it's interesting to read. So I would like to share it with you. So, anyways, moving on. Take a break, Eddie. So, what's happening? So, um, they have the little video, and I think it's it's cute. This really is cute. I just and mind you, uh, this reminds me a lot of my two forty when I had uh, uh, my uh, uh, we changed the tie rod so we can get like a turning. Oh, <laughs> this is a lot. <laughs> this is a lot. Uh, uh, basically, so we can turn even sharper. How do I say this? Like basically, so we have a. So basically we can drift and we can catch the car drifting. So we had like a really mean angle, but not to this level. This, this things are going crazy here. Uh, first thing you can tell is they cut a little bit of the fender. You see that? Because you couldn't really clear it. You can tell, right? That this is kind of a, somebody came with a hacksaw went, because <laughs> it's not even clean of a cut. But it's okay. It's a, this is a prototype car. I'm, you know. So look at that. Brake by wire, steer by wire, and then the dampener. Look at the rear. Uh, by the way, you can see it's protruding a lot forward, obviously. If you, they don't show you a lot of it, but that's Korea. If you haven't been to Korea, it's fantastic. Uh, see the wheels are kind of sticking out a lot. They're really sticking out a lot, but hey, it drives as a prototype. I think it's fantastic if you live in, uh, in, a, in an environment where parking is uh, kind of hard to get to. Look at that. It's just literally both wheels turn 90 degrees. Look at this. It is just fantastic. Look at that. Oh, a parking spot. Do I need a parallel park? Nope. <laughs> ah, the how pretty this is. Come on. If you're not impressed by that, oh, <laughs> next they're going to make you do this with your phone. Oh my God, that's just fantastic. <laughs> Can you imagine? And then we'll just tug back in and you're set. Oh, this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. The future is beautiful. <laughs> oh, look at that. Everyone to turn 180. Zero. They call it the zero turn. Look at that. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. What should I do? and it's like a space rover oh come on if you don't like this come on this is awesome this oh, i can have so much fun with this i can have so much fun with this oh that's fantastic oh that's fantastic it's i can't wait to bring this technology Ooh, the pivot turn even have names for it it's like it's just like the x games they got names for all the skateboard tricks you do now there you go the pivot turn Oh, oh, that is sick. Oh, <laughs> that's sick. Oh, that's, I can't wait until that a lot of horsepower to this and then just go crazy with it. Shh. Come on. I mean, I'm pretty sure AI is going to help drivers because maybe their brain won't figure it out. But regardless, once you get driving, they probably get used to it. <gasps> Diagonal driving. Oh, that's going to mess with somebody's brain. Oh, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> no, come on, stop it. <laughs> stop it. This is like four wheel steering, okay? I, uh, I did have that, but not that it sticks. Oh. <laughs> this just looks, I'm sorry. I'm laughing at it because I can't imagine the regular commuters that are like, what's going on? They probably think they're drunk. What's wrong with this car? Oh, I love this. I love it. Oh my God. I, I really can't wait to bring this technology. Yes, we need it. Yes, we need it. Let's go. Let's go, Hyundai. We need this. Oh, by the way, Korea is fantastic. Korea is. Again, you haven't been to Korea. Oh, just let you know, man. Korean folks can drink. You gotta, you, gotta, you gotta hang. You gotta hang when you go to Korea. And the food. Mm, delicious. Delicious food. Uh, okay, that's it. Uh, man. Oh, bringing back memories. Anyways, um, so what else? So what they're talking about, let's get to the point here. They're saying, oh, well, basically the video shows you everything, right? So they're talking about the, the e-corner system can also transfer tight 180 degree pivot turns. Yep. 
I just love how they have names for it. I hope they patent all these names because they're so awesome. The 180, the turn once. Oh, I can't get over just watching this. The zero turn. <laughs> Executing zero turn. Anyways, uh, yeah, I, I can't get over this. Uh, can you make a zero turn? Please, can you take it? You take any driver license test and like, can you execute a zero turn? Absolutely. Look at that. I can't get over this. Uh, I like the one that actually the one where the only the rear pivot, so you can just point where you want to go to the parking spot. I think that was really clever. The zero turn is also awesome. The pivot turn. Oh, it's called, sorry, it's called the pivot turn. I got my terminology incorrect. The pivot turn. Choose any point of uh, for center axis to rotate the vehicle accordingly. Come on now. Oh, come on. I bet you somebody out there is going to come up with even better tricks how to use this. Shh. No, no. Just into the parking spot. Hey, if you're going to Disneyland, you know Disneyland parking. Hey, there you go. Easy breezy. Anywhere where you go when you need parking in a tight space, this would work perfect. So, anyways, um, that's pretty much it. I think I think this is fantastic. I don't know if the technology will make it into our shores anytime soon. I mean, oh, that this is like my favorite view right here. When it turn like this and just goes. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Can you imagine? Now you see me? <laughs> now you don't. <laughs> this is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Yeah, so hopefully it'll bring this technology soon. I cannot wait for it. And of course, this technology is only going to be available in an electric car. It's not going to be available in internal combustion engine for obvious reason. The axle, unless you're going to dislocate the axle so you can turn that way at that point, there's no power being transferred to it. I guess you could do that to the front wheels, but you, you know, you, I don't see you able to do this to the powered wheels. So you can do the rear if it's a front wheel drive. You can do it to the front if it's a rear wheel drive. Even to the front, the amount of space needed to do that. Oh. Um, but anyway, forget about internal combustion engine. Electric car. This is this is it. I love it. I, I just the pivot turn. That's one of my favorite. The pivot turn. Sheesh. <laughs> Changing lanes with it. I think I over like it's, it's just sliding across. Uh, just, uh, you think I call it a bad alignment? No, sir. It's just that's how I change lanes. All wheels turn in the same direction. How about you know what I think about it? I, I wonder the stability of it. Oh, you can see it by the way. If the rear tire, I did the same cutoff for the rear tires. Huh? Let me stop. I'm like, nye, 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 nye. Let me stop right here. Yep, they did the same thing. Look at it. I mean, it's a prototype. I think also what you're looking at is the wheels are pushed out more. That's why it looks like off centered. But I don't think it's off center. It's just that it's pushed out a little bit more. The wheels are kind of sticking out a little bit more, just to accommodate the uh, the mechanism required for it to turn, which is completely fine. And again, they did the cut off in the back a little bit, but I mean, if you put in smaller wheels, they'll probably solve the problem. It's just that I want to put those big wheels, but that's fine. And again, those are things that will iron out. It will be ironed out. The production of this vehicle at some point. Again, there's no uh, comment as far as one that's going to be available, but this right here, diagonal driving. Look at that. I mean, they're doing it at a slow speed. I wonder at high speed. How how would that work? Very interesting. Um, <laughs> this looks weird. <laughs> um, is that necessary though? Honestly, that one is probably my least. Uh, I want to say favorite, but I don't. I don't know if it's necessary. Uh, I I I think that one is one that we could live without. But this, the other ones are fantastic. It, if you understand why you want diagonal driving, I mean, I know four wheel steering it helps when you turn to turn in, and actually four wheel steering works that way too. It kind of uh, moves the rear tires to give you kind of some what the stability at high speed. But anyways, um, there you go. That's from Hyundai Mois. So uh, we'll see how that goes in the future. Hopefully, they eventually uh, bring it in because I can't wait to have it. I would love to get my hands on it. Anyway, as always, um, let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you everybody. If you like this video, uh, please uh, do like and subscribe. It helps a lot. And I really appreciate everybody who subs and uh, like. Uh, it's really heartwarming and it's uh, really humbling to see uh, somebody out there likes, you know, my little, you know, one man show here. So <laughs> anyway, as always, thank you everybody. Have a good one out there and be safe and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.